All right, we've about finished up the GMC. At least our part of it is about finished up. Of course, it's gonna get paint and body. In fact, I hope he drives it as is for a little while. When this truck first came to me, um, it was just the cab and the chassis. Um, basically replaced the whole bottom of the cab, smoothed the firewall, did cab corners, filled the gas filler, did a few things on the inside, and then it left. For a little while, then it came back to me wanting to do something custom in the bed. So we did that, which also turned into valances in between the bumper and the bed. Of course, we chopped the bumper off a little bit. Yes, of course, it's sunk down in the bed. Put the GMC in there. Did the flush mount door handles. Shaved the vents on the side. Shaved the cowl vent up top. Did a valence on the front for the front bumper. And we don't normally do the mechanical end we normally do um, fab work you know chassis suspension Probably the fact that it only has headers on it. Go ahead, you're good, do your thing. Talk to me. <laughs> Open headers are going to sound right. <laughs> going to sound like a truck. That's right. Raise hell, praise Dale. Oh. -ho. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Yeah. 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 Throw the readings off. Gotcha. But, that being said, we should be. We don't need no stinky no food sensors. <laughs> What did you think about that thing? What you think, Greg? I'm recording you. Man, it's, it's like night and day. Night and day. 
It's like night and day. Yeah. Night and day. Yeah. Man, yeah. I mean, we got the, they got the response, we got the power, yeah. everything. Yeah, yeah it's and Like it's you said, crazy. it will got to put you on. Oh, yeah. You got to be careful. Yeah. One more time. And that's it for the GMC.